Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Yeah. I'm so sorry to bother you. I'm trying to sell this pineapple for $10 to get my mom's med medication. Do you think you can help me out? Um, I don't have 10 bucks, but I got, uh, I got seven. You want to give me the $7? Yeah, you, have, you, take seven. you can keep this pineapple too, matter of fact, actually. Keep the pineapple and keep the $7? Yeah, well, the pineapple's for your, med your mom's medication, right? Yes. Um, you are so sweet. Do you mind if you want to come with me, sit here for a minute? Sure. I know you might be busy. You're going somewhere, man. Yeah. But I just want to talk to you for a second. Up. Oh, so you want to give me the seven dollars and yes. plus, you. Oh my God, yeah, man, you are like an angel, bro. Like I went to so many people, literally like begging them, sir, help me out. My mom needs some money for the medication. Nobody wants to even help me out, and they're telling me to go find a job. Some people are even pushing me. Yeah. People are so rude, you know. Yeah, I've been there, you know, you know. When you say I've been there, what happened? Um, there's a lot of uh, people that don't really help, give you the help that you, when you need it, you know. And I feel like you know people should help. You know, we're humankind, I mean, you know, be kind to people, you know. So where, where do you live right now? Where are you? Right now, I'm homeless right now. Oh, I'm so sorry, man. I, I didn't even realize, like, you look clean and good. And oh, yeah. You got to <laughs> stay fresh because people, people you judge have to. you. You have to. People, people judge you yeah. a lot. And, the, I mean, depending on how you look, and you know, that's where you get based on treated Bro, how they treat you. That's that's definitely the point. Sometimes I go to the store in sweatpants. Yeah. and looking a little dirty yeah so people think you can even afford this like people even yeah, look give yeah. me those looks exactly. like you can afford this and i'm like okay yeah you yeah. know and i i still honestly i still pray for them like god bless them and i i don't have any hate towards those type of people and as a human i feel like it's a human nature we all judge each other True. and, and it, it happens so if you, you you said you mentioned you're homeless how long have you been living on the street for a while a couple of years now already more than two three. Two years? Two or three years. Two or three years. And if you don't mind sharing the story, what exactly happened? How did you end up? Um, well, I mean, I, I, was, uh, um, I was younger back then. I was, you know, troubled. Uh, got into some trouble. Um, parents didn't like it. Parents threw me out. I stood with a friend. Uh, my friend who was working at the time. Um, then apparently he got laid off. Couldn't pay the rent. So me and him had to leave. So both of you guys ended up on the street together? Yes. Pretty much. Wow. Um, now, when you said the friend got laid off, like, did they fired him from the job because yeah. um, because of a, his behavior, or was no, the company he got just fired, uh, for the, the, It was uh, during COVID, so like the company had like it wasn't doing so good, so they had to let him go. And, and they had to had a, a lot of people let go. Yeah. yeah, and that happened around that time, like in 2019, 2020. Yeah, a lot of companies were going out of business, and so many problems were happening. So it was kind of like hard to to stay where you can actually pay your rent and right. stuff, you know? Yeah. Um, and if you're given a job today, like today, if I tell you, hey, I got a job for you, what would you be willing to do? Really, um, pretty much anything, really. Anything? What was your past background? Like, wh where did you, have you worked anywhere before? Or um, yes, I worked at McDonald's, with uh, warehouses. Um, okay, so you, yeah. you have a retail, a we, warehouse, yeah. like a warehouse and also like a, a store. Yeah. Okay, perfect. That's good. And, um, as far as food wise like when you go oh i forgot to even ask you man you gave me your seven dollars right yeah what were you gonna do with that money um so buy some food with it probably and and that's that's the only seven dollars you had or you yeah. had more money no that's seven only seven dollars that's all you had yeah and you decided to still give it to me yeah why i feel like you needed more your mom needs it more wow bro like you're an angel bro like I, I just mentioned to you that I went to so many people nobody's wanting to help me okay. but you gave me everything you had the richest people in the world don't want to give or help and I feel like the people that don't have enough they're still willing to give everything that they have it's funny because that is true though I mean it is and I feel like because uh, you know, money is the root of evil you know and greed comes with it so like the rich wow. people that have it don't really want to give or help and you, you live on, among you know the people that are on the streets yes and I have met some before and I've helped some before and to be honest they're one of the best people I've ever met yeah. they're the most willing like if, even if they have a dollar two dollars and you ask them for help they're willing to give you everything they have yeah well, sometimes some of us are willing to give us uh, you know the, the shirt off our back sometimes you know yeah yeah it, this is this is just crazy one question I ask everybody do you believe in any high power God or, and then again this is not to judge you you have the right to say no or you don't want to answer this that's okay but if you can answer it that would be great do you believe in anything yeah high power, I believe, in high power. You believe in high power and when you say high power do you like believe in like that there's a god there or I you are a christian or i believe you, in god or you believe in god okay yeah. great that's awesome 
and any message that you want to give people right now that are struggling with financial issues like what you have gone through what your friend has gone through any advice that you know you could have done this and you wouldn't end up like in this situation some some of the mistakes and we all make mistakes again right. not to put you down yeah not trying to offend you um we all make mistakes i've done big mistakes i've created big problems in my life and we all make mistakes that's why we are human we're not god we are not perfect you're right god is the only one that's perfect right. but we all make mistakes so what would be the mistakes or things that you have done and you would recommend people not to do what what would you say to to people like that um this i think you know what based on your story let me tell you if i was in your situation i would say to have a backup plan for a job oh, that's how you get fired plan. from the job right? right you have to have a backup yeah. job lined up um where you know what hey i got fired no problem tomorrow i'm going always to the other way i always have a backup plan so, because you know i mean yeah i always do no matter what situation is i always have a backup plan cuz anything can happen anything and and again another message is life can change no like, matter yeah, you're right, no yeah. matter you're rich no matter you're driving the nicest car exactly, no matter whatever yeah. your lifestyle is it takes only one second to lose to burn down your house yep. to lose your car get in an accident or even you get in a car accident you get paralyzed you're on 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 yeah. on even the bed when, even when things are going well for you just still have backup plans for anything you know just always anything have a plan. and everything let's say if you're a married man right you got kids I would say buy some life insurance. God forbid something happens. If you're the bread maker in the house, yeah. buy life insurance. Right, yep. God forbid something happens to you at least your wife and your kids are not going to end up on the street. Exactly. So you you went away from this world for a good cause. At least you know okay my family's protected. Right, exactly. They're going to get a million dollar or half a million dollars or whatever policy you can. And people be wasting so much money in drinking, partying and all right. that stuff, but they don't invest the money in the right place. Right, like a savings, a savings. savings. Like my 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 friend, he could have had a savings, you know, but like I said, nobody thinks about the worst or nobody thinks about the, you know, what if, you know. And what if this could happen? They yeah. just want to live life, yeah. Live the life. Hey, let's go party. Yeah, yeah. Hey, let's go drink. Yeah. Hey, let's go spend this money on exactly. girls or whatever, yeah. whatever. Everybody has a different life. Yeah. Not to be judging people, but we are just giving people a good advice like, "Hey, you should be doing this." instead of this right exactly um, and while you were walking there like honestly i thought that you were walking to your car oh, like yeah. i thought that was your car i no. uh, because like i said you look so fresh and good thank you and man like you know god bless you man uh, you know what here i wanted to go ahead and give you this uh, pineapple because this is not a regular pineapple go ahead and see it says something on there 3000 3000 3000 do you think i'm selling this for $30000 just because i have a tag on it and i mean i don't know but <laughs> you, you, you mean here you since you decide to help me man i want to give you oh, no, no, give no, this no. for you and uh, no it's okay it's okay keep it keep it you, you put it to, towards the, like uh, the, uh you know donation for you know another another cause you, a good cause you don't want to take it no no oh my god man this could change your life like you could literally be off the streets and no, 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 I, I, I understand that, but it's better if it goes to a donation for a better cause, though. Wow, man! Good God good. bless you, man! God bless you, bro! It's, like you. you're such a great man. I wish we had more people like you in this world because when people see money, that's all they want, and and it's so hard to find people like you, bro. So God bless you, man, Thank and you. and I appreciate your time and sharing your story with me. God bless you. All right, have a blessed day, man. You too.